What's up, guys? Today I'm going to show you how to install Android 7.1 AOSP on your Espresso Wi Fi Samsung Galaxy Tab 2 10.1. Here I'm using um, GTP 5110, and now I don't have computer anywhere. So, here, how, here's how to do it. First, you need to go to the downloads folder. I'll link in the description below for these three files. Otherwise, there's two apps here. One is called Rasher and one is and Reboot. The app and Reboot is optional just in case you don't need to push the buttons to boot in recovery. First, you're gonna go to your downloads folder, hit King Root, and hit the little green thing. So, hit, hit install. And once it's done, just open it. You will open it vertical. Swipe up until you see this blue button. Then you're gonna you're gonna check. For, it's gonna check for root. If it's not rooted, you can root now. Uh, I'll continue the video if it's rooted. So actually, I'm using Android 4.1.2, which is not that hard to root that. So, wait, it just, and hit try root, yeah, then I'll give back when it's done. Okay, so now if you see the screen, that means you are successfully rooted. So after that, you're gonna switch to another app that allows you to install a custom recovery. So because Rasher does not do what I want, so I switch to this official twerp app. Just open it. Then you're gonna if you have if you have just installed it, you will ask you to check all the box, then click I agree. Then you're gonna ask grant super user access to it. So once you get into this game, hit for flash. So my device is um, Samsung Galaxy Tab 2 10.1. So I'm gonna scroll very bottom. So Samsung Galaxy Tab 2 Unified. Here you go. Press the Wi-Fi. Then you're gonna hit the image, which is in, which is the second one. Then hit OK. Then it will start to download and flash. I'll come back when it's flashed. Okay, so now it views download successfully. Now you're gonna hit the, the second button, flash to recovery. Let's see what it says. Hit OK. Then it will start flashing. After it's a flash complete successfully, you're gonna go back to home screen, hit end reboot, then hit recovery. Then you you have to grant super user access then. Hit grant allow. Then you will get to reboot your device. Then you will see this screen. It probably works like a minute or something, but soon. Then hit never show this screen again and swipe. 
So to make sure that you have those files that you could download, so image let's see. No, it doesn't do anything. Okay, I'll come back when I found the image file. Okay, so now I found those files in, the, my, in my micro SD. So we got downloads. First, you're gonna hit UA Expresso. Then you're gonna hit add more zip. Open G apps. Then reboot after installation is complete. This. Wait. Hit wipe. Wipe first, then use the download query. I'll come back when it's complete. After it's flash complete, it will show you a screen like this. This, do it at your own risk. So, I'm gonna choose do not install. So that takes less space for it. Then it will boot into the current firmware. So it takes a bit long time to boot up. But hopefully and everything went right. So just wait for it. And until a green splash, then you'll get into the screen. That means you're successfully booted up. Uh, okay, the first boot take me quite a long time. But actually, this is gonna work fine. So, but I have a very special tutorial for you. Because this is on Legacy. This is not that simple. So, you see? Hit, let's go. Then it will just stop responding then. Look. So, wait a minute. So when you hit setup wizard has stopped, then you hit open app again. Now you have to quickly swipe down from the when you actually get the, no the notification bar. Just turn on the Wi-Fi. Let's see if it actually works. Okay. Who I finally get it. So now you're gonna let the Wi-Fi open until you see a question mark. Does it actually do? Yeah. So I'm gonna wait for a couple seconds to make sure that it doesn't it don't turn off again. Yeah, so now tap set up as new. Then you will get into the Wi-Fi. Now you don't get that error prompt. That's a very important trick. If you don't follow up your system update might be failed no i did not mean that just you won't get the actual functionality to get into your home screen directly so now i'm gonna continue when i finish my wi-fi and google account setup okay so now we're almost there and now you can scroll down click ok Now you can click next. Yeah, adding a, adding finishing adding finishing touches. I went back. Okay, what's going on now? Yeah. So, this is what you get. This is your end result. It works pretty well. This is all you get. Okay, so here it is. Thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe. Hope you enjoyed. Okay, so now we're almost there. And now you can scroll down and click OK.
Okay, now you can click next. Yeah, adding a f adding finishing adding finishing touches. I went back. Okay, what's going on now? Yeah. So this is what you get. This is your Android server. It works pretty well. This is all you get. Okay. So here it is. Thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe. Hope you enjoyed.